Hi guys, thanks so much for the opportunity to provide you with this informational video on how you can optimize your online presence and increase your revenue targets. Let's get right to it. I'm going to go into Google here and type in Roofing Ventura. And what you'll find is at the top, these are the companies that are running advertisements. Then you'll have the map. And just below that is what's called the Google Map Pack. These are the top three companies that pop up under that search for Roofing Ventura. This is where you want your website to be ranking. They pull in about 40% of the online traffic for this specific search. So let's take a look. We'll, we'll use shadow roofing here as your, what we'll refer to as your competition for the purposes of this video. Let's take a look at their website. There are three things that will rank your website with Google. The first is content. You want to have about 1500 words on your home page. Um, it looks like they have pretty good content, though I don't think they're quite at 1500. They might be more around a thousand, maybe a little less, but they do have plenty of content in there. Again, 1500 is about where you want to be for Google ranking. Let's take a look at your page and see how much you've got. Uh, you really don't have any, um, very little content. So that's an area that you'll want to bulk up. And the reason you want to bulk that up is because the second thing that, that Google uses to rank your website is keywords. Let's take a look at their website. So I took their website and plugged it into my database here. And they're being ranked for 47 keywords. I also took your website and plugged it into my database and you guys are only being ranked for nine. So let's see which nine keywords you're being ranked for. Your own name. So those don't really count. Um, and then you've got hot mop roofing that gets 150 searches per month, but you're in position 49, which puts you probably page 10 or 12 of Google. Camarillo roofing. You've got a search volume of 30 per month and you're in position five. That's pretty good. Roofing Ventura has a search volume of 20, but again, you're in position 66, which just means you're not using this enough in your website. Let's take a look at the keywords that shadow roofing is using. Again, the ones with their name don't pertain. Uh, they've got Roofing Ventura search volume of 20 and they're in position nine. Roofing Ventura CA, search volume of 30 per month. They're in position 12. So these are probably still on the first page of Google. Rain gutters Ventura, search volume of 10. They're in position two, so that's definitely first page. Ventura roofing, search volume of 100 per month and they're in the first position. So you see the more use of these specific words that are often searched will get you ranking higher. The third and final thing that ranks your website is your backlinks. And when I go back to your data here, you guys don't have any backlinks. And what a backlink is, is it's essentially a referral back to your website. Uh, it could be a blog post, um, a review, an online directory listing, uh, anything that mentions your website and links back to it. Let's see what kind of backlinks Shadow Roofing has. So they have 72 backlinks coming from 34 different domains. And we'll take a look at those so you have an idea of what I'm talking about. So they're listed on top right and local uh, keyword basket, localarea.com, the Ojai Biz directory. Um, they're in a couple of different uh, local Yahoo's, Roof Info. You see, it, so they do a lot of blogging. So there's some blogging posts on blogs that re reference back to their website. Any reference back to your website is going to give Google a trust rating for you and rank your page higher than your competition. So if you have any questions or if you'd like to implement any of these processes and getting your website ranking higher and bringing in some of that 40% that goes to those top three, 
please feel free to reach out and let me know. I'd appreciate some feedback regardless, and I really hope you have a great day. Thank you.